Obviously, it had anything to do with games. I do go to film conventions often because I've done so many films. And it's usually film students and what have you, and they, they want to know more about the filmmaking process. And uh, one thing you have to do if you're dealing with a low-budget independent film is you have to stay with the plan that you have developed before you get into production. Because if you start making changes while you have that tiger by the tail, you can have a lot of problems. I think there was another question over here. Yeah, yes, go ahead. Way, you were talking about tickets um, earlier. Um, <laughs> a lot of the movies of that era, it seems like um, usually whenever we have, like, you know, when we take the top off and everything, it's more of like the comedic aspect. And I'm wondering, is there, as a director, do you look at, okay, if I have this percentage of that in the movie, it's funny in certain parts, but if it starts to get, like, more and more, like, you know, like Kentucky Fried Movie and this movie, mm -hmm. Hot Dog and things like that, it's funny. So if it's a little bit, you know, it's a little bit over the top. Is there like, do you guys actually look at that as like a percentage of your content? I don't think so. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I, I, actually, when you're writing the script, you try and, and make something interesting happen, and hopefully, like if it's a comedy, which is what I prefer, and hopefully you thought this was a comedy. Uh, Are you kidding me? Uh, you, you, you try to make something. Thank you. You try to make something interesting or funny or amusing or story point every three or four minutes. And the more you can do it, the better you are. Now, as far as the nudity in this picture, almost all of it is just silly comedy. There's a brief, brief amount when the guy's with the girl at the end, the flashback saying how he loved her and so forth. But uh, it's all done tongue in cheek and it's all done hopefully to get a laugh. The girl, the blonde girl, uh, Kim Mallon, was a Playmate of the Month. Yes, she was. A few months before we did the picture. Very, very uh, pleasant, uh, cooperative young lady. Has all the cast. Cooperative. Yeah. <laughs> well, that explains that whole dressing room thing, doesn't it? I'm kidding. It's totally professional. You know, I, you know, it, it, a movie I did, another movie uh, in the same kind of genre, Surf Two. I don't know if you've seen that, but there's a scene in it where um, I'm hit in the uh, in the face with a breast. And uh, and the breast that is that explains a lot, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Typecasting at that point, and um, glycerin on the breast, and we shot it for three days. <laughs> I don't get it. What's, what, what's, what's funny? <laughs> that one shot. Yes, sir. I had a question. When he was playing Pac-Man and had almost a million points. Yes, I did. Hours to do that. Uh, it took almost two weeks of the filming, which took 17 days, so almost two weeks. Okay, I'm kidding. No, the, the fact of the matter is we had technicians there that were able to make the numbers come up to whatever we wanted them to. Honestly, in, in the thir 28 years, um, and uh, there have been a lot, you know, it amazes me, the, the amount of emotional response by, by you gamers to this film. And I, I've, I've been addressed seriously, face to face, with people going, how did you do that on back? <laughs> and when I say theatrical license, they go, no, really. Well, I always, I always paid my theatrical license. <laughs> ba -dum -boom, huh? Now he's going to do comedy. That's what I like. Okay, the, uh, uh, about 28 years ago now, I realized, gee, I devised this story and I didn't have the rights to use Pac-Man. Son yeah. of a gun. So I got a hold of the people, I think it was Midway or Nintendo, or the, 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 the companies changed so often, but I got a hold of them up here in San Jose, and we were down in Los Angeles, and I pitched them on the idea that, that they should allow me to use the Pac-Man figure in the movie. Of course, you showed them no footage or anything. So, uh, no, no, we hadn't shot yet. So, uh, uh, so I flew up here, and uh, convinced them, and, and what closed the deal for them to, because I didn't have any money to pay them, what closed the deal for them to allow me to use the Pac-Man figure and to show them the various games and what have you, is I told them that I was going to feature one more video game. And I asked, do you have a hot one coming, you know, six months from now that's gonna be released? And they said, oh, we've got the Satan greatest Hall. one in the world, it's gonna be the biggest video game ever, ever, Satan's Hollow. 
<laughs> so that's why we have Satan's Hollow in the picture. It was a trade-off to use that so that I could get the Pac-Man figure. Uh, so you know, that's... knowing people following on Facebook, um, by the way, follow me, become my friend. It's under Jim Greenleaf, not Dorcas, but follow me. Um, <laughs> uh, there's been a lot, of, a lot of folks that have have, and, and I remember uh, 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 Job in the back there. Hey, Job. Uh, hey, buddy. Um, he, he looked me straight in the eyes the other night at dinner and says, uh, have you been practicing Satan's all? And I said, no, why? Because that's what Jerry's got going there. I probably shouldn't tell you, but you better be practicing. Okay, cool. Uh, anybody else? Question? Okay. Yes, sir. I'm just curious about your, I mean, with your budget, how much was spent on props, obviously getting that many games for your location. You know, that went to the laboratory for film and development. And then Joe Don Baker was fairly expensive and all these other actors and so on. Come on. So, uh, <laughs> uh, what happened was I, I, I again went to my art director when we were devising the set and we wanted the stairs to go up to the little uh, eating a snack area and so forth. Uh, we said, how many games do we need? And we figured, I think there was about 30 maybe in there. Uh, and.